Hey there guys, what's going on and welcome back to episode 5 of the Ultimate RTG. And you know how I was saying we haven't lost yet, yet being the key word, we have now. Two losses already on the account, what's gone wrong? Absolutely everything. No, 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 not as bad as that. But yesterday I was in the 442 formation and I, I do enjoy it, I do enjoy it. But something about my attack just wasn't right. So I fancied a little bit of a, a freshen up, went to a 4 one 2 one 2 rebuilt the RTG team and took that into divisions and I started seeing a little bit more of an improvement. We were actually winning and scoring a lot of goals. And then we had one game, one chance to get into division one and I lost. I got absolutely destroyed. I came up against the Bamiang and Werner and they just kept running past my defenders. So then I had to claw my way up and I was grinding again, another opportunity. And this game is going to be played out for you right here, right now. If you're enjoying this series, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button to not miss any content. This is for Division 1. Let's see how we go on. Now we've got a second chance. Division 1 is coming. The Road to Glory team. He's using Chiellini. First time I come against Chiellini, Romagnoli, Donnarumma. Um, he's got some nice technical plays in there. Verratti, interesting. Maybe he'll play well this year because of his dribbling. Mine, 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 mine. Yuri, 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 you're the man. Uh, chip, chip here, chip here. And this is the initial Thank you, keeper. Today. I see that run over that right hand side, but I also see that run from Porto, and he's been absolutely fantastic. And he hasn't read it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, this one. Just pass it. Finish, finish, finish. No. Yes, yes, pin. Yes, I definitely saw that. Nah, the main man. The main man, Rafa. The only one that I really, truly believe that he will not let me down. Bottom right. Rafa, yes. Yes, terrible pen though. Thomas, 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 Thomas. You want that, you want that, you want that. Too slow, too slow. Too slow to, to push up like that. If you're going to push up, at least have some pace. You, what you idiot. Good dribbling. Porto again. No, no. Oh my God, did you see it? Oh my, Thomas though is eating the balls. Yes, Rafa outside of the foot. Oh my God, he's, he's too good. Division one. 50,000 coins. Uh, well, it's early days. I mean, it's 12 minutes in. But 50,000 coins. Coming in here with that toxic vibe. I'm winning 2-0. Maybe I'm playing you. So I've got to give you a loss. <laughs> Sorry if you're trying to get to Division 1. But hey. No, no, no. No. Keeper, 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 keeper. Oh, okay, 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 okay. You've put me off now. We need to focus. Oh, no, no, here, here. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Yeah. Oh my god, this keeper is not giving me any confidence whatsoever. I thought he was good, and now he's now he's messing about. Valverde back heel. Oh, that was that was very nice. Through ball. Come on, Rafa. What? Oh, come on. Yes! No, how have you how have you taken that ball off me? Oh, you thought Rafa, of all people, in that position would have buried that. I do like the chips this year. Valverde. Okay, now Valverde fancies it. Ah. Uh, Rafa. Drag back, bang! Oh, good save, Donnarumma. I think for this 4 one 2, one two it's, it is imperative to be using a far centre mids. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Rafa, that was unbelievable. Rafa, Rafa, Rafa. I know Porto's just scored, but Rafa is just the player that I really desperately need. Yes! No. No, not like this. Slide, slide, slide. No, 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 no. Oh, that's painful. That's painful. 64th minute, 3 2. Drag back. That's good. That's good. That's good. That... Another player. Yeah, Chiellini. Good lad. Good lad. Thank you. Yeah, yellow card. This is surely to seal it. Division one. Here we come. Right bottom corner. On the track back there, trying to fight for the ball. Oh, please, no. Oh, my God. Can I get... No, a draw might be enough. A draw might be enough, boys. I get 100 points as well. Close to qualification for foot champions. He had 1,900. Okay, yes! Oh, no, I needed four. No, I needed more than that. 
So obviously I can't count, but I wasn't really concentrating on the digits. Well, I was when I saw 3-3 after being 3-1 up. No, I threw that game. And that's something that I really need to get good with. Plug the gaps. But our skill rating is 1,893. One more win required, and that gets us into Division 1, 50,000 coins. That's something that I'm going to be doing today. Well, let's hope so. I've got a new team as well because I want to experiment with the 4-1-2-1-2, but I don't want to fully commit and go and purchase, like, too many players and then I sell on the ones that I've got and then I have to go back to like a 442. So I just want to put together a team that looks fun, creative as well with some special cards. I've got some players off cam, but it won't make any difference. I also have some squad battle rewards. So let's go and claim that. Bronze 2. Well, the thing is, right, unfortunately, it's unfair on the game right now because those that have got the full release, they can sit there playing 30 games, job done, and they've got an extra 40,000 coins, 50,000 coins. Whereas us on the 10 hour trial, we're a little bit restricted. So we only get to play like a few games or no, 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 you don't get to play just a few games. It's up to you. You can prioritize your time. You can go and play squad battles if you want to. But I just feel like for myself, it's a little bit of a waste. But I want to show you a really good player to trade with right now. Let me just open up this gold pack. It is Callum Wilson from Newcastle. And there's a number of reasons why. Well, first of all, um, the Premier League strikers, the majority are just very, very expensive. So those that are getting the game and want to build a Premier League side, they're going to look at the pace and you've got Callum Wilson. But balanced, that's right. He doesn't look amazing, but he's going to be valuable. As well as, he's English, easy links, and then you've also got that potential in form. I think they're going to give it to Alante Maxima, but Callum Wilson, he did get the goal. So mm, maybe, like... Uh, I wouldn't put it past EA, giving it to Wilson. So if that is the case, he's going to be taken out of packs and he's going to go up. But what I would recommend to do is just snipe him for like 2002, 2003, and then just list him up with ease. Um, I wasn't doing as much trading as I really wanted to. Uh, last night, it was just focusing on the game. I did say that I was uh, really wanting to get together. Here he is. Um... There's one here, did I sell for 2000? Yeah, 2008, 2009, and he does come on the market for about 2001, 2002, so you can get rid of him. Uh, these two cards, like, right? So Rodrigo, they still haven't adjusted his price range, and when they do, he's gonna be about a 40, 50,000 coin play, in my opinion, and then Edmund Atel is gonna be about 40, 50. So we've got a lot of coins tied up there, and that's why I wanna get into Division One. So I can get another 50,000 coins, so I can maybe purchase one or two extra. EA, I don't know what they're doing right now. They're holding off. It must be for a reason. They know that a lot of people have over-invested in those cards. They've got the data, and they don't want to uh, give us extra coins. Now, I know you're going to look at this team and think, gee, what the hell is that? What are you doing? Now, I did explain that I was wanting to experiment with the 4212, but not go too crazy. And one thing that I've had issues with is a lack of speed in a CDM position. So instead of me using Valverde as a right centre mid, I'm going to stick him as a CDM today. I just want to experiment with a few cards. Now, this Salvio I picked up, by the way, there's another overpowered player that I need to speak about. Um, but Salvio I picked up for 1,004. It was a really nice snipe. He sells for about like 2,005 or so. Five-star skills, four-star weak foot. His stats look very, very nice. And I'm going to stick him as a right striker. Outside of the foot flare, amazing. But this Buffarini, he is... In, in like SBCs, advanced SBCs. So I bought him for 5,002, and I think that's a little bit expensive. Um, yeah, I think that's a little bit expensive. I, I, that was a snipe as well. I could maybe get like 5,007 or so, or 5,005, like lazy buyers, but he is probably going to get price fixed looking at that. All right, sweet. But yeah, price fixed and more. But his stats are pretty, pretty solid. Like, He's not worth 5k, but for the formation and for the chemistry, I really needed him. Then Acuna I bought for 3,004 as our centre mid, high tie work rates. So high tie work rates with Acuna, high tie with Lorente, CDM, which is Valverde. And then Jal Felix has been playing very well, by the way. And his price for 17,000 coins, let's just quickly check if uh, he's on the market no for 17,000 it is definitely worth it wonderful shots just he's impressing me every single game that goes by but this card here Porto that I was using in the game that you saw insane on the ball for an 82 stat he is wonderful really has that low center of gravity his finishing is superb as well um fantastic fantastic card but it's another player that's extinct Sorry to say, you're going to have to get your sniping filters set and, and try and get these cards because EA 
are holding back on adjusting the market. But the most overpowered cards on the game right now, with no shadow of a doubt, the best card, and it, and it doesn't even come close, is Rafa. And if we are considering using the 4-1-2-1-2 in the weekend league, now I don't know where I'm going to play him. Because right now he's, he's being put as a cam, a middle cam, and it does work. But do I require a bit more passing and, and not just pace in that position? Maybe. But I'm going to show you how. Um, yeah, I'm going to show you how I'm going to set out this team. So we've got Grimaldo, obviously going to be playing as our um, left left back. Uh, Edit. I think I play Edit on the. I think I play Edit on the right. Oh no 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 no. The four one two one two is quite literally the worst formation to switch everything around. Yo, what's happening with my game? Is it broken? Uh, Lorente, we're going to play on that side. Then we've got. Um, yeah, Acuna up and down the pitch. You've got Valverde playing as a CDM. And I want to change my uh, instructions. So that looks that looks good to me. The instructions I've been told to stay forward. Oh, no, some of them are already set. Not stay back while attacking. Drop between defenders. And correct me if I'm wrong. Aggressive interceptions. No, I'm not going to have aggressive interceptions. So correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, someone was saying that that tactic is only applied when you have the ball. So when you've got possession... Your CDM will drop between defenders. So if you lose the ball, I don't know if you've noticed, but sometimes you'll get caught in that transition and your CDM, they will just pass the play and you won't have time to like quickly switch over to them and then defend with that. Whereas if you lose the ball in like the halfway line, then your CDM will then start pushing on and be in more of a defensive area to play a switch and, and try and uh, stop them from attacking your back four. So I'm going to experiment with it. I don't know if it's the go-to tactic. I'm not sure, but it's something that was recommended and I want to show you uh, it today. So we've got, a, we, like looking at that team on paper, it's not that bad. Considering that I don't want to go and purchase like too many cards. Uh, otherwise the market is just going to drop and we're going to lose coins. Like so, like most of these players, I'll probably sell on before any soon, like Salvio and, and Porto, but they are they are pretty good players. Well, these two I haven't tried yet. So 4-1-2-1-2... This is the game to get us into Division 1. It's huge, boys. We need to win. I want 50,000 coins so I can trade and I can also put that towards the advanced SBC. Do you know what I might do? I might use those coins and invest and complete Hybrid Nations tomorrow. If you want to see that, drop a like. Wish me luck. Let's go. I'm nervous. But once again, third time lucky. Wow. RTG squad. Verna I keep coming up against and he's horrible. Goretzka, Fred, Havertz. Oh, no. No, that's a goal. That's too too easy. Way too easy. No, nah, no. Nah, we need to start getting better. This is ridiculous. It's easy, easy attacks for my opponent right now. Good, good, good. Come on, come on. Valverde, we're still in this game. Come on. Acuna. That's it. Nice. He's using really, really low... Um, this guy's using really low depth. Oh, sorry. This guy's using low depth and low width. Come on. Take advantage of this. Here. Rafa. Go on, Rafa. We need we need a bit more movement. There's so many players just sat right in his box. Rafa, yeah, use him. Acuna. Oh, grab that, grab that, grab that, please. Oh, no, somebody's there. Maybe I should have had that. He is retreating a little bit now. Or is he starting to bring some players out? Here. Middle. Come on, come on. Those passes there, we need to really hit them hard. Yes, Felix. It is a decent looking attack here. Felix, oh, that was gorgeous. Felix! Oh, I thought that was it, boys. Oh, that was really, really nice work. Um, but you can see how this guy is playing now. He's got his goal and he's he's really sitting back. So if that invites the pressure, we should be fine. Felix on the edge. Use that one, Felix! Oh, Jesus! All right, all right, all right. Yes, now we're starting to warm up. It was my first game on today and that was a wonderful, wonderful goal. Cunha is not bad on the ball. I think he's got 86 dribbling. Um, it's another player that I think for his price, right? He may as well stick him in the midfield. I was going to do that with Marcelo, but Marcelo doesn't actually sell. He's got like 11,750 star price. No one wants him. Yo, middle. Yes, what a ball. Yo, Felix, Felix, Felix. Oh, Salvio. Yes, 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 yes. First time. Yes, come on, Rafa. Yes. Oh, Rafa is so good. Ronaldo. Yeah, oh, 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 yes, that's open. That's a lovely pass. Believe it or not, Salvio. And then flick it like this. Yes, beautiful. Salvio, five-star skills. Oh, wow. Wow, they always start to turn up. We've got two five-star skillers. And that Elastico, you see that? That is instant. That's a really, really good skill move this year. Felix, lovely. Now we're starting to build up with a little bit more confidence. Rafa. 
Rafa. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> See what I mean? You can't get the bloody ball off him. It's the, it's the Portuguese Messi. Oh, oh, I hit the other post. People say that there's a power tackle where if you hold RB. Ah, no. Ripped open. Oh, that was a light goal. 45th minute, rubbish positioning from me. If you hold RB and press tackle, um, it does like a real, really, no. Oh, thank God. Uh, it does a really hard power tackle, like instant. But it, that's only if you know you're going to get the ball. If you do that, and you're doing that all the time, you're going to commit, and then they're just going to pass around you. So make sure you don't do that. But three attempts, two goals, that's what I mean. The consistency from Jao Felix is at a high level, which is sweet. He hasn't had much possession. 66, we're, we're killing it. 96 pass accuracy. Shame that we conceded that goal right on half time. So it's given him a bit more of a lifeline back in the game. We need another goal. Yes, he is. Lorente, Felix. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. This is where it's really, really worrying. I'm going to have to track. Oh, no, 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 no. No, he's got me. He's got me. That's as easy as it. Oh, thank God. Thank God. You know what I mean? Like, yes, you're using a Damatore, but my God, can he even hit the barn door? Probably not. I can see Acuna's run, but I, I don't. Like, I'm just going to use him as bait. I want to switch this right there. Yes, perfect pass. Come on, that's going to get us on the front foot. Lorente. Yeah, maybe a little bit of a switch. Salvio. Wow, 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 wow. Was that Edison? Did he start moving the keeper? I think he did. Who's that running over here? Is that uh, Salvio? Salvio. Good control. That is a foul. You edge, edge. But don't lose it. Otherwise, we'll get counterattack big time. Slip it through. Finish. Uh, let, let, let's like close in here. Oh, no. I hate this position. It's bloody horrible. I don't feel like I get any tackles in whatsoever. No, that's shocking. No way, no way, no way. That is ridiculous. Joe Felix, nah, not good enough, not good enough. He's just parking it and now he's going to catch me on the counter. That's it, he's got me on the counter. I, I tried to go in for the challenge and I couldn't do it. Nah, he's got me. Oh, no. Maybe I've got to lower my depth as well. Maybe that's uh, it's too easy with the dribbling and it's 5-3, it's, it's game over. Full time, in the end we lose 5-3. I thought we were playing well, but the one thing that I'm not doing right now is parking it. And playing against a few more people around this level, it seems to be that way where they have got so many players inside their box and they're ready for the quick counter-attacks. And if I don't play that way, I'm going to get punished because every time I lose the ball, I only have like really my back four back. And that's how it feels. So we're going to have to make improvements somewhere, but... Oh, man. A little bit upsetting. He was using 4-2-3-1. Then that makes me question, do I really want to use the 4-1-2-1-2? Do I want to go back to the 4-2-3-1? I don't know. We started playing well in the game. Uh, first half, it was really all us. Second half, we, we fell to pieces. Werner, Dembele, Traore. I just couldn't pick him up, boys. I could not pick him up on the wings. Uh, especially when, like, Acuna and Lorente have pushed on and they're trying to support the play. Just got exposed. I, I could not pick up the pace. Um, so, that was a shame. That was a shame. Um, thought maybe that was going to be the game where we come away with the result, but nah, uh, feels bad. All right, maybe we're going to have to rethink the team. Some of you guys might question, well, Fuj, what team have you put together? And I'm not going to disagree with that. It is a bit of a weird creation, but like I explained at the start of the video, I don't want to go and spend too much on cards, but maybe I'm going to have to. Like if we're playing at this level and we're coming up against good quality opponents and teams, we're going to have to put together a side that is solid. Uh, I just don't know what formation to commit to. Like, uh, a, a part of me wants to go back to the 4 2 3 1, my roots, knowing that I, I like the player positioning, but I was still having issues with the attack. Uh, the 4 4 2 was nice for a couple of games, and then that went off the boil. 4 1 2 1 2, it's like really 50 50. Some games are really good in the attack, and then other games I can't uh, stop my opponents from counter attacking me. Um, so it's, it's going to come, right? So my plan is right now is to. Um, Try my best to grind later tonight to get into Division 1. If that's not the case, fair enough. I'm going to invest coins and I'm going to complete the four hybrid nations or hybrid leagues, whatever it is, uh, for tomorrow. We'll have like 50k pack, um, rare mega pack, whatever comes from those, which are tradable. Fingers crossed we can pack some really nice cards that we can use in our team. But the formation, um, that's something that I'm clueless on. I I'm stuck. I'm trying tactics. I'm trying formation. And nothing has clicked so far. It will come, though. 
And it's just practice makes perfect. And that's why I love and also hate the game at the same time. The reason why I hate it is because I'm finding it difficult and you don't want to play something that you're not good at. But another thing that I, I'm loving is because it's actually a challenge and I feel like it's going to keep me engaged and interested for the whole FIFA because it's going to take some time getting good at. So anyway, thank you very much for watching today's episode. Let me know um, in the comment section what you're struggling with as well and we can get better together. So thanks for watching. Team out. Peace.